Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to another episode of Tachito Rant. Last time during the Demon War, we beat Camila. She is dead. We kind of beat the Apostle, though we need to get her. Oh, we need to find her by going in here, I guess. Um... Yeah, I guess. Uh, we beat Babalat by putting him in a giant pitfall to his bears is carrying. It doesn't look like, because he's in lane bow, but it doesn't look like we can interact with him. So currently we have Red Eye attacking Kites, I believe his name was, is attacking Bald Man. Um, Silk is on like a freaking guerrilla warfare mission and she like absorbed Camilla's soul and she gave us like a time limit, which I actually kind of forgot. What it was but basically i think we need to kill enough demons so she can become strong and be our ally i guess so here's where the situation is red eye is army is so fucking strong there's no way i can like brute force it we know we can kill him if we kill the girl um we know that f actually like i kind of got my memory refreshed because at the beginning of this turn Freak actually, like, knows him, which makes sense, because he's fused with the Toshin Toshi, so maybe we can get some help from Freak. And we know Kite is connected to this village, and he's a little easier to fight, to be honest, if we bring the full force. So that's kind of the situation. We can't really go on the offense. I mean, I guess we could technically, like, sneak in here. Attack Kessel Ring. The thing is, though, I'm pretty sure another, f like... We're not done with the attacking force, right? Isn't there like one or two more demons coming soon? So it's kind of hard to go on offense. We could also go after Medusa. Um, but like, do I wanna? Like, I feel like we could brute force kite, but another option is we could. Oh, it's so risky though. It means we can't brute force at all. Another option is we attack Medusa. Because I'm pretty sure we'll have a strategic option to beat Kai using this village somehow. And I'm pretty sure we have a strategic way to beat uh, Red Eye. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's a strategic way for everyone. I don't know about Camilla. Maybe that's like later down the line. But I would like to get Medusa because that's where um, both uh, the Flame Girl forgot her name and uh horn it is and that could actually be really big it's it's risky though it it's really ballsy just leaving them there so we're gonna these these turns might be short i mean like we might not even get to the three turn limit but these turns are very impactful so how's our subordinates i definitely want to talk to freak just in case he gives us information Oh, Rant is like dead. We need to heal Rant. He's like the most vital unit. Oh my god. Kentaro's weak. Oh, my fucking units are weak. Okay, who has... I'm fine with Satella having the D thing. Do I bring Mickey? I've been like saving Mickey. But maybe I should just bring her. I just thought it was like... Kind of a bad idea. But maybe it should work out. We could... We could give emergency nurse to... Why is Patton, like, dead? Oh, I guess we sent him to the dungeon. Oh my god, it's so hard. No, Plupit. Actually, Plupit's not horrible. I will... I will just fire. Ooh, ooh, nice woman, isn't she? Do you dislike female warriors? No, no, I'm glad to have you. You'll be fun for my eyes, my hands, and my hyper weapon. Tee hee hee hee. Rand smiled perversely and extended his hand towards Cecil. Swoosh. Oh? Cecil avoided Rance's hands. Why do you do that? You didn't purchase me as a woman. You purchased me as a warrior. Is there an option for me to do that? There are people that sell themselves for that purpose. I only sell myself as a warrior. So that means I can look but not touch. It depends on how you look. Ch, lame. I'd prefer you not expect anything from me as a woman, only as a warrior. There's also the condition I gave Plupit for handling me as a mercenary. Yep, that's right. Duh, I should have said so earlier, Plupit. 
Now allow me to head to my lodging. Hey, maid over there, lead the way. She still walked away from the throne. She's a cool lady, isn't she? Can't fuck her, though. Not very sociable, but she's quite skilled. I guarantee she'll be used, use, she'll be of use to you, King, for sure. Clap, clap, whistle. Hmm. Well, I'll just take her. We can. We there's a there's a very good chance we're resetting this turn, anyways. I feel like dungeons are important. I mean, we can send someone, but they're gonna be shit if they're not Patton. I mean, we need to heal rants. Who has emergency nurse? I think Patton has it, right? Yeah. You. I. It's important to have Patton on emergency nurse just as we need him for dungeons, but. I think having it on our fucking. On our demon guys is the best. Just give it to Midlass. It's like not too important they have it, but it's it helps, which we need. We heal Rance. I think Rance is just the strongest, technically. And he's the and the demons are tankier, so we'll do that. Isn't can't we construct something? Oh not yet. Seven wheats. Oh yeah, okay. Uh, how is Melfus, by the way? It's month seven, week four. Uh, we, we have to do it next turn. Okay. Oh, man. So much brain power happening. What do we do with our action? So we have one play. And I forgot exactly how to do it, but we can get the old man to work for us if we spend two actions doing something. Like, loving some specific place than recruiting him. I kind of want to investigate the village, just because that's definitely the key to beating Kite. So we'll try that. We already saw this, but I kind of want to keep this quest open for now. So we actually read this last time, explaining the green inning disease. But we'll, 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 we'll activate that for now, and hopefully that'll lead to something. We'll talk to Fruit, see if he can say anything important. Maybe I'll meet with Freak. Ho oh, ho, you called Rance. Yeah, it took you a while, old man. Hmm, I wasn't sure what clothes to wear. Man shouldn't be should be quiet and always wear the same clothes. Ga ha 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 ha. Old man, yes? What's your reason for helping Patton? Oh no. So we read this, so it's not that. Maybe we can send them to fight. Obviously we're not going for the win. We can just retreat immediately. Unless he has something special. Oh, the big decision is attacking Medusa. It's kind of stupid. But I guess the play would be... You send an attack force, not including Rance, to just kill all the generals and make her weak, then send, like, the full demon slain force. But even that doesn't guarantee your death, but it's still better than nothing. Let let's get a little crazy. Fuck Medusa, man. I feel like it can give, it can give us generals, I think. Dude, it's so much, it's so more nervous playing in this phase. It's fun though. Alright, let's try it. Uh, we should, uh, should, what if we just fail though? We can hear him later. It doesn't affect it, I think. Alright, fuck you, Medusa. So we save Rance for later. And we'll just go attack force. And by attack force, I mean... Does Cordoba get a boost from anyone? Okay, this isn't cheating. This is just me being optimal now. Finally, in the late game, try to be optimal. I don't think Cordoba gets a partner boost. He might though. Um, no, he actually, he gets nothing. That makes me sad. Yeah, okay, well, if he gets nothing, then we can just put someone random. We could go Millie and then play with Mill. Millie Mill's a nice combo, actually. And then go Maria. Does Maria get a boost? 
Or should I just go Isoroko? Isoroko's a pumper. Does she get a boost? Wait, she has a special attack? I've never used her special attack. Oh, shit. Does it say what she does? Whirlwind shot. Special attack and use after wait. On the following turn. Oh, it only does one point of damage. Okay, that's kind of lame. Good to know, though. Let's, yeah, okay, this team seems fine. And they're all pretty healthy. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, wait, Medusa's there. Okay, she's frontline with 4,500? Excuse me? Excuse me? I'm sorry? Ooh, can I push the general? Kinda wanna try. Oh, whoa, no, no, no. All right, let's try to attack the generals. Like, what the fuck, why are they so strong? Oh, it's just we're in a castle. It has to be. Why are they so strong? All right, let's kill the generals. Dude, Millie's so strong. All right, just honestly, just auto defense. You're more useful. Like, do I just... Uh, well, it's too late to go for... Oh, they have 10 HP. Oh, this is... This... I don't know if this is the play, guys. Can we at least kill one of them? What? Why is she in a castle? It's cheating. Alright, he'll kill himself. So we can start working on this guy. I'm scared to melee attack her, but... Alright, we got one down. Let's just do our best. And... Yeah. Not bad, not bad. Alright, let's go. Do you think we have enough? For the did the chad squad? Are we really bring Let's try- Let's see what Mickey does. I've been scared, because I feel like- Like, I don't know, is it right to bring her in the lines of battle? We could have brought Gandhi. Gandhi might have been the play, just because he does some nice uh, percentage damage. For now, we'll do something like- Oh, I just Midlash. I mean, we're only done a high speed with Midlash. Uh, whatever. It's still safe, I guess. All right, let's go. No. Okay, so attacking generals literally does nothing. So we need to. Just focus Medusa. Which is tired. So there's no point of whittling her down. We just go for. Luckily, she's not that strong. Mickey, where's your nuke? Where's the RNG nuke? <laughs> when, oh, Satella so needs to snipe too. So I should have just been bringing Mickey, eh? Guess it doesn't really matter. Alright. Well, so it's a two-turn thing. For sure, at least. Did we... No, we didn't. Maybe I shouldn't even bring Satella. I think it's fine, though. Last, you're kind of ass, but yes! Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Wait, that's re that's really good. Wait, Mickey carried us. Let's go. Wait, we win, right? Unless Ranch dies, but we win. No! <gasps> Why did he do one? 
Oh, uh, we we have to go for RNG. Yes! One turn Medusa! Okay, we can't we can't restart this turn. We got Mickey RNG, baby. Medusa fell in battle. Oh wait, no, we have to win! We have to win! Oh fuck you. Oh please don't revive. Oh no. These fucking monsters, man. Ah. Ooh, 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 my lady. No, I like the LF guard. I think this is the end for me, LF guard. Please don't say that. I mean, I guess we still killed her, which is based. Come, my lady. I'll let you sleep in my lap as always. It's an old man's lap, but it feels good, does it not? Yeah. Oh, this is most unfortunate, my lady. I... Yes, what is it? I still had things I wanted to... I don't feel bad for Medusa. She's kind of hot, though, but that's about it. Oh, oh, I'm sure you did. I'm sure you did. I feel bad for LF Bird. That's all. You're still young, my lady. Your prime was ahead of you. This is too, too cruel. LF Bird. Yes, my lady? Could you listen to my request? Yes, of course. It'll hurt. Yes, that's quite all right. Perfectly all right. Thanks, LF Guard. Medusa transformed into a small snake. LF Guard, let me sleep inside of you. Until the time comes when I resurrect. Yes, I'll happily oblige now, my lady. The snake slithered up LF Guard's legs and... Ooh? Ew, up his butt? It slithered into his rectum. Oh, my lady. My lady is inside me. Go. LF Guard groaned at the feeling of the snake squirming inside of his intestines. Gwa, gwa, gwa. The snake wriggled. Ah, my lady, please rest inside me. Please. Ah, oh. This demon turned into a blood demon blood so and slept inside their apostle Elf Guard. Aw, so she's gonna kill him. Okay, I mean, I guess we, we won. <laughs> That's good. Do I have to press the attack? Or can we chill? I really don't want to make a mistake. Ah, uh, Rick Layla's weak. Her ruins. Dude, everyone's fucking dead. Who Who's the healer? Can we go to, like, the freaking... This is the place with full heals, right? Oh, wait. The village is a... Oh, the village is a dungeon. Check. Right? Yeah. Oh, shit. I didn't know that. Yeah, we... Should we set this up to get full heals going? Oh, I kind of want to push the attack. But I also... I need a team so Freak can at least go out and not just instant die. If I can't run away. And that'll be like... Manad. I just need tanky boys. Like... Manad... Oh my god, everyone's fucking dead. Manad bears at us, so we can't... We can't attack. There's just... There's just... Too much defeat. Oh wait! Oh yeah, I have Cecil! What am I saying? Dude, I paid bid money for her. Okay, I'm sending her Manad. Hunty Maria, maybe? Does Manad get a boost? We need to know this stuff. Let me let me let me check all of these people. So um Let me open Cecil. Manad. Hunty gets a patent boost, right? But it's kind of useless. And Maria. Maria might get a Shizuka boost, actually. Okay, Cecil. If deployed with Millie Yorts. Oh, so she's a Millie combo. Okay. Oh, that's really good. We can make a base team with her, Millie, and Mill. Super boost. Manad. Oh, she has the occasional Kento attack. Konami attack. Um. Hunty's just chilling. Oh, wait, no. She can get. Yeah, Patton boost. 
Maria. Oh, Maria gets a rant boost. The more you know. I feel like... Okay, well, I'm gonna attack it then. Because I'm not a bitch, but... We don't... We can just give up land, honestly. It's fine. I should actually just bring Dondi. Why am I not bringing Dondi? Hunty Dondi is pretty sick. So we go you and... Oh, I need a team to survive. Okay, Manad. Oh, this is so risky. Whatever. As long as we don't fuck up hard, we'll be fine. Who the fuck are you? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Cecil's a beast. Oh, yes. Just just attack Cecil. Surely you'll be fine. Uh... Actually, I probably should kill one, just so Cecil can attack uh, the bigger one. Oh, no, why is Manette attacking? That was a mistake. Whatever. Okay, so we're gonna be, like, recruiting Cecil every turn. <laughs> probably. Gandhi level up? We'll take that. And get some more control. We can go directly to Red House. Okay. Well, that was something. So let's work on getting that other general was it rose guard i need to check sorry we checked this last time so we already cheated so it's not really cheating again right lily kill so we need levy archgrad to add amira into the harem you do not need to eat her in the harem sounds kind of blasphemous but where's wait what is it archgrad i already forgot uh, da, 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 Archgrad. Where is that? Not Rosegrad. Archgrad. Oh, the Lady Caravan's there. I totally forgot about that plotline. Well, I'm gonna need a levy, so... We're working on this plotline for now. Oh. I found a sweet orphan the king should like. Good work, please send just for the queen, maybe I can take her home with me. Don't be thinking anything or rash. No, it was useless. Oh, maybe I didn't do all the steps right. So is he just not recruitable? Well. Kind of a waste. It's okay, it's nothing too vital going on. Now, here's the hard part. We cannot die here. We'll have a Satella up. Oh, wait, no, I need a harem. I don't really have anyone. I think I was gonna go for another whale episode. And then tomorrow will be, uh, Malphus. Okay, I'm gonna whale it up, BRB. I am whaling! <laughs> hmm, would be nice if I could get something besides this whale one. In a while, like an army of beautiful girls. Damn it, I'm gonna complain. Hey, whale. The world's gotten even more interesting than before recently. Why is that? Ch how dare a whale <laughs> ignore me? Oh yeah, it's because there's war. Hmm, I see. How stupid, fighting for peace? That's so dumb. But it does make the world more fun. Oh look, a bunch of people are dying again. Ha 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 ha. Why has there been such an increase in war recently? So there's this like an omni, an omni whale, like watching over the world. I don't like it. Rance woke up from the dream and sat cross-legged on the bed with a dissatisfied look on his face. I feel like it's making fun of me. That swim toe was shivering. What, you shaken up? Yeah, the whale wishes to see people hurt each other. It enjoys war. Okay. Who's fighting for peace? I don't know about anyone else, but I'm fighting to make everything mine. Damn it, it's underestimating me. If I ever see the whale, I'm slaughtering it. 3 XP? Okay. Alright, boys. Now, this is the hard part. We need to live. And there might be another demon coming. But we definitely don't want to restart this, because we got Medusa dead. <laughs> oh, and we got a free Satella. Don't forget about that. 
key bliss. Oh. Oh, oh, this is probably a still key. In front of Medusa's room. Aleph Guard was cleaning up the room. The lady he was supposed to serve still inside of his body. Ah, <sighs> dear, dear. Ow, my back. Aleph Guard was flustered by the pain of suddenly extending his bent over back. At times like this, if my lady were alive, she would hit my back for me. You're truly annoying, humans. If you want to see Medusa so much, then I'll let you do that. Huh? It's me, Aleph Guard. Miss Silky? Where's Medusa's soul? I, I don't know. I don't know anything. Yes, truly. There? Huh? Now, I'll send you off to be with Medusa. So long, Elifgard. Yeah! So to use Little's thick arms to rip Elifgard in half. No, my boy. Elifgard's corpse was tossed to the floor. A, a red orb floated from inside of it. It was Medusa's demon blood soul. Medusa, sorry, but you won't get a chance to revive. I'm taking all of your power. Hoo 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 hoo. Hoo 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 hoo. That was a grand entrance, Silky. Fine, I'll eat you through your spirit from inside you, and eventually I'll become you. Hoo 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 hoo. Yes, do as you will, but it'll be futile if you take too long. I'm going to die soon either way. Silky swallowed Medusa's orb. K. Ah, an impact like a lightning strike ran through Soki's body as she lost consciousness. Ooh, <laughs> damn it. A good while later, Soki staggered back up. Soki became much stronger by absorbing the power of another demon. <sighs> Soki's breathing was rough. Not yet. This isn't enough. If I don't power up more, I can't beat Tableus. Do I have to no choice but to wait for the human forces hurry and kill more demons for me before my life ends yeah i'm trying all right this is red eye this is okay barris uh do we go harine one turn i need to though all right they they'll get a bonus off each other let me just go Freaking be chill. And we run away. Hey, where's Freak? There he is. Alright, go. And we attack, maybe? That body. Is it a Toshin? No, there's something off about it. Wait, it has to be. That's Toshin Gamma. No, the man that rode Gamma died, so why is this Toshin active? Hmm? Old man, is there something you want with my glorious body? What are you? Why are you using Gamma? Oh? You know about the Toshins? Great. Beautiful. An outstanding old man. What's with this thing? Hey, will you answer my question? Oh. I found this body during the Demon War. This dead body belongs to me now. It's strong and durable. Perfect just for me. For me, just batch. Mm. Perfect. Cool. How dare you mock the dead? The man that died using that was my friend. If you ridicule my friend, I can't let you live. Prepare yourself. Mm, the old man's cold water. Well, run away. Retreat. I don't know if that did anything. But there is a... There is some dialogue. Okay, kites. We just abandon. I'm sorry. I don't really have anything. I need to, you need to defend it twice, but we used way too much resources. And new demons kind of drop, right? Oh no, village. Okay, this is important. Seth Green Village. Calorie. Ah, Kite, hello. Here, I brought you a gift. Kite showed Calorie the giant lump of meat in his hand. Well, wow, this is some quality meat. Thank you. What is it? For a moment, Calorie cringed and she looked uneasy. It didn't escape Kite's notice. Uh, um, hmm? Why? Why what? Why do you do this for people like us? We were abandoned by humans, but you're so kind to us. Um, Kite, you're a demon, right? I heard demons don't associate with humans much. And if they do, um, it's to kill them for fun or... But, but not you. You don't seem like you would do that, Kite. 
but you don't have anything to gain from being kind to us. Is it just because you feel bad for us? Calorie. Yes. Greening disease has been around since I was a human. Yes, 500 years ago. Kite began seriously talking about himself. Calorie understood and quietly listened to his story. I was five at the time, I think. Well, this was a while ago. I don't remember exactly, but I was a child. I had an older sister. My parents were busy with work, so she took care of me. She was my only sister. She caught greening disease. As soon as she did, she was sent here to Green Village. I wanted to see her and pester my parents. But when I did, they hit me. When I did leave the house to try to see her, they dragged me back and beat me. That was when I became determined to get stronger. With strength, I could stop my parents from holding me back, and stronger I got, the more prize money I could get. To me, getting stronger and doing Kempo was a way to get closer to my sister, however little that was. I got strong, strong enough that I could crush anyone that told me to do anything. It took 10 years. That's when I was able to come to Green Village too. When I saw Bat that then wasn't the beautiful place that's here now, it was much more awful. Due to being so close to the monster forest, the monsters attacked all the time and killed people. Even if anyone managed to get out, they'd return to the city, they'd be forced to come back. It was terrible. My sister died before I got there. I don't even know how she died. They only told me that the girl I described wasn't around anymore. I lost my sister. It came as a great shock, but I couldn't let myself die then. Sometime, some good came out of this. I guess you could say I was strong. Strong enough to make money. So I continued making money in tempo matches. I used that money to try and improve this place, and then the next thing I knew, I became one of the demons. But whether I got stronger or became a demon, how much time passed, I couldn't cure the greening disease. What I can do is continue bringing money here and kill any monster that, that attack. That's it. Yes, because at least in the end, I want to be able to say I was happy. I obsess over this place for myself. Calorie hug kite tight. Calorie? Calorie continued to silently hug kite. She clung to him as hard as she could, like a lost child. Kite gently patted Calorie on the head. Oh. Oh yeah, this guy. I totally forgot about this guy. He rants if you don't act soon. Fuck, I can't do anything. He's the food guy, right? Yeah. Just leave it. Just leave it. Om nom nom. Mmm. -hmm. This pink union, cold and refreshing, just right for my tired stomach. Something refreshing makes me want something greasy. I got it. Potato chips, seaweed flavored. Hum 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 nom. Choo choo. It's good. All right, I'll try the crab flavor. Thus, in this fashion, Deltia ate everything there. Audience room. King Rance, once again, Galtia has. Again? Don't give me the details. It's depressing. Man, what a guy. There's people in the world that have to worry whether they can eat tomorrow at all. Rance said while munching down sauce flavored potato chips. Is there no good way to handle this? There may not be. Man, what a glutton. I sometimes, as someone with a delicate stomach, thinking about this is. What is it, King Rance? That's it. How about we use poison? Poison? Yeah, poison. Prepare all our poison. Yes, understood. Okay. So it'll be like the pit thing. I don't think a poison would kill a demon though, right? Oh, Cezo. While Rance was studying sets, sets positions in the throne, Cezo appeared before him. Oh, hey Cezo, finally decided to make love with me? Nope. My job's done, let me leave. Ah, uh, I see. Hey, Cecil. Yes? How about quitting being a mercenary and work for me? That'd be more fun. Yep. I've got some good women as subordinates, so you'd have some nice competition. Ha 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 ha. Ha, I'll think about it anyway. Then how about a farewell kiss then? Farewell, King Elisus. Cecil turned away from Rance as he puckered his lips and quickly walked out. Cecil? Ah, Millie. Where are you off to? I finished my job here, so I'm off to search for another. 
I see. I pray that we don't end up on opposite sides. I wouldn't want to be your enemy. Hoo hoo hoo. I hope not. As well. See you. Yeah, be careful. She's a left loser's castle. Okay, so we have options. Do we go on the offensive? Like, this is just the death pit, right? I don't really want to take that over. We're feeding Silky. I mean, I guess the next place is Castle Ring. But we'd have to go through two places. Now, normally the forests aren't too hard. Judging from last time. But the thing is, we do not get enough troops back, man. Also, I, I, I realize I'm a fool. I probably shouldn't give emergency nurse to uh, Midlass. Just let him high speed, whatever. That was a misstep by me. Let's let's give it back to Patton. So we can get him dungeon ready. Do we just go here then? See if Ranch can do anything. Hoo hoo hoo. Ranch was at the entrance to Green Village. This is where the girls infected with greening disease are. Seems dangerous, but I'm here because of a piece of information I got. Apparently Kite, one of the demons, comes here often. There could be some key to defeating Kite here. Also, green skin or not, this place is full of girls, which means it's pretty much a harem. I can't let this place go, overlooked. Ha 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 ha. Alright, going in. Rance lumbered into Green Village. Oh, who's there? Hmm? Um, who are you? Healthy people shouldn't come here. I'm Rance, the king of Lysus. Huh? A king? Why would a king come here? Who are you? Ah, oh, yes, my name's Callery. Greenstin, are you sick? Yes. But you're obviously a nurse based on that outfit. Excuse me. Ah, this, I'm ill, so, but I can still move, so. As long as I can move, I want to help my suffering friends. Carly laughed hopelessly. It was somehow lonely. And also filled Rance's sadism. Um, okay, I was just feeling the lonely part, but good for you. By the way, Calorie. Yes? Do you have a boyfriend? Uh, no. But Calorie blushed. Hmm, even if she doesn't, I can see she's not someone she likes. However, I won't back down just because of that. I see. You must be lonely. No, I... I'll take that loneliness away! Huh? Ka ha 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 ha. Kia! Well, we made love with Calorie. I don't know what that means, but... Also, I, I was worried, but then I remembered it only affects girls, the green disease, so... Nice. Ah, oh, that was good. How was it, Calorie? Seemed like it was your first time, but... Your Majesty! W what? Please don't... Please get examined by a doctor. It could just be superstition that greening disease only affects girls. R really? I can't stand to see more people suffer because of my disease. Tears built up in Calorie's eyes. Wait, don't cry. I don't like when girls cry. Then... Huh? Hmm? Calorie, you... Huh? Oh my god, they only need a penis. Has no one tried making love with these green girls? That's crazy. <laughs> uh, you, a mirror. Look in a mirror. What is it? Just come on. Huh? Kia! Rance pit Calorie and ran into a house. No way. How? Calorie whispered to herself after looking in the mirror and seeing her skin was a normal color. Must be my miracle. That's your majesty. King Rance. Ah. Get, Maris. You were gone, so I thought you'd be here. A king shouldn't. More importantly, Maris, have Calorie inspected. Huh? Why is a normal girl here? When I came inside of her, she turned back to normal. Came inside her? Did you really make love with a girl with greening disease? Yep. What an animal. Understood, I'll have you both inspected. Hey, Maris, I don't really need it. Maris was expressionless as usual, but glared at Rance with hostility. Got it. I'll take the inspection, man. Man. Thus, Rance and Kelly were inspected by medical care staff. Maris, what are the results? And I did it for both of you. No abnormalities. Well, look at that. But how? I have no idea myself. I only believe it was a miracle like the king said. Hee hee, so do you accept I made miracles? 
No female soldiers from 10 to 19 were brought here. As such, we don't have to worry about anyone getting infected, so let's spend the night here. It's already late. Is that acceptable for you, Teen Rance? Fine by me. Calorie, are you okay with camps being set up here? Uh, that's fine. Thank you for letting us spend the night. Teen Rance, the medical team will try investigating the relationships between greening disease and intercourse tonight. Why? It may be possible that everyone here can be cured. Will you allow it? Ah, uh, if you can cure them, then cure them. Understood. Then Rance and his cohort spent the night at Green Village. That night, a number of sit girls that saw Callie and heard the details snuck into Rance's tent. If they made love with the teen, they might be cured. Though on the verge of ending their own lives, they wanted to cling to something, five of them made love with Rance. All the girls that made love with Rance were cured of greening disease overnight. Huh. Rance yawned and exited the tent. Good morning, Teen Rance. Hey, did you figure anything out? Yes, it's unbelievable though. What? The cure to greening disease. Oh, what is it? You've determined that it's semen. Huh? You've observed it many times now, haven't you? It seems you had fun last night. Gulp. How did she know? Ah, well. No man has ever been either reckless or courageous enough to make love with someone with greening disease before, so... Apparently nobody ever found out this was a cure. That's so tragic. <laughs> like this awful disease for over 500 years. I mean, to be fair, it kind of made sense, but... What a tragic situation, man. Gahahaha. <laughs> That's right. I'm not just cruel, but courageous, too. What shall we do, Teen Rance? According to Calorie, including the critically ill, there are 300 girls with greening disease here. Well, then, bring the young guys from my army here. Just tell them I'm letting them make love with cute girls. If there are 300 of them, then I can't do it alone. Understood, then I'll make the arrangements. But, it's funny. Now this incurable illness everyone was scared of is done for. All thanks to me. ha 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 ha. True. Actually true. It's pretty noisy. Rance's unit came to Green Village. They're starting to cure the girls with greening disease. Kite appeared while they did. He became he came with a bag full of money as usual. Kite? C calorie Yes. Your your body. I'm cured. My greening disease was cured. What did you say? Not just me, the other girls too. Was a cure found? Yes, it's a fairly rough me method, though. Calorie blushed. I see. Who in the world found it? The king of Lesus, a man named Ranstead. King Ranstead? Do you know him, Kite? Ah, no. Calorie gazed at Kite, who was staring at the entrance to Green Village. Then... Yes, according to the king's attendants, the world doesn't have to fear greening disease anymore. I see. That's good. Then my role is done. Right? I really didn't want the girls to here to be unhappy. I lived up to now in an effort to give them even temporary happiness. Yes, I was happy. I was always waiting for you to come, Kite. Kite looked at Calorie with a gentle smile. Give me your hand, Calorie. Kite gently took Calorie's outstretched hand and put the bag of money in it. My last gift to all of you. Divide it between yourselves. Kite? I won't come to this place again. This place will probably be abolished. But will I ever see you again? Well, I'm a demon. Being this close to a human isn't. N no. C calorie? No, I, I don't want to be separated from you, Kate. Calorie, you... I... I love you, Kate. <laughs> I've always loved you. Kate, don't tell me you're leaving me. If you do, then, then bring me with you to the world you live in. It's too different. It wouldn't work. I can't get used to it. I can get used to it. I can get, I can do it, so please, Kite. Calorie cried and clung to Kite's arm. Ah. Calorie fainted and collapsed into Kite's arm. Kite gently knocked her out with his finger. Calorie. Sorry. Kite slowly laid Calorie down in the shadow of a tree. I can't bring a kind girl like you to the world of demons. You're a kind, good girl. Only the human world is safe for you. You can find a kinder man than me. His words may reach Calorie's ears. New tears ran down her cheek. Goodbye, Calorie. Take care of yourself. 
live in happiness, do what my sister couldn't, experience many things. Head strip and walk back to the land of demons. Well, I don't know if that beat him, but maybe he'll be friendly. Here's the real problem. Everyone is fucked up, right? Now, the easy solution is just don't attack this turn, which might actually be the case, because we need to heal Rant to use our most integral uh, player, which means we can probably just take a step back. Um, especially if we can beat Kite. Or if Kite's gone. But he seems like he's just chilling. Man, that freaking red eyes cutting such a deep hole. Also, we need a poison. Yeah, we can go here and old Zeth. I mean, we're gonna do that. Rance came with his subordinates. Alright, that demon Galtiel. Come here eventually. We're leaving food that might kill him with food poisoning. Ah, uh, that's right. Give this order to the mayor. Tell the citizens here that eating this food will kill him. At Rance's order, a large amount of food was left about. Okay, so we have food ready. Dalti is attacking here, right? I'm pretty sure he is. Or, no, this was Kite that it took, took Papaya's tower. Now we could do like a mini attack horse and just take like some random shit land. Cause this, this, it's probably not bad. I want to heal Rance. Use our Giga Chad unit. Uh, maybe talk to Freak this time? He has something new? What would we like with an old man like me? No, this is the same. I think. Do you have a hyper weapon? Oh no. Misunderstanding. <laughs> okay, good meme. Maybe we'll send free to Den? It did something, but I don't know, like, what. I kinda, like, how's our funds? It's not bad. Spending a mil a week. We, we make more than a mil, but we're slowly use, losing, uh, units, huh? Alright, let's try to sell it higher. Um... Give me bid, bid lady. It's good to see you again. All right, get the fuck out of here. I mean, opening Kessler, cause this is gonna be slightly harder. Like who would we send? Layla's not healed yet. Rich's kind of healed. Does Rich and Layla boost each other, right? I believe so. Let me just double check. Oh, Rick doesn't boost. I think Layla does boosted, but Rick just has the by Layla -la attack. By la la la. Uh, yeah, she gets it. Wait, did I didn't actually check combat? Yeah, yeah. So Layla gets the boost. We could go get a Chad team, but I don't know if I want to use that on offense. That might actually be a sick uh, anti-red eye team. We go get a Chads. If that's the case. Well, if I'm attacking no one, I can go Satella. We can also have Mickey. Mickey's kind of a Dilla Chad herself. Hard decisions. I kind of want to open this up. And try to take Castle Ring. Probably next video, to be honest, but... Sure, how bad can this be? We'll go... We won't go to the Chads. We'll go... We'll go something casual. Like a Hubert. A Hubert... Menad? Hubert, Rick, Maria, 
Well, if I'm... Mm, we can probably do Isoroko, Hanty. Or what? I always forget to bring Dondi. Dondi's like, actually a Chad. Oh, these guys are kind of strong. I feel like he's killable, though. Hubert... What does Hubert do? Hubert is... I don't think he has any. Oh, that's the Patton. We could make a Patton team. It's just, like, kind of bad. <laughs> like, kind of, like, trash, to be honest. I don't think I need to wait for Gandhi. I'd rather just attack. Wow, that's unfortunate. But that's okay. These monster generals are pretty strong. Isoroko is pretty strong, though. Alright, well. If you're not gonna attack, I'll finish you off. Really? Okay. Let's work on you. Ouch. They are kinda strong. This is a success. They did lose more health than I thought. Why is this monster general so strong? <laughs> 18 XP? Little bone forest, zero economy. It's kind of a cleaner path though. I think it's fine. Alright, that's done. Harem, I need to do Melfus, so BRB. Oh, apparently I didn't need to do Melfus. I think I miscounted because she's normal. But whatever, we're already here. Okay, well, you got a bonus, Melfus. Be happy with yourself. Little 4 XP never hurt anyone. Uh, I guess for Gucci. Alright, well, we're gonna have to hodl this turn. I think it's fine. We can, like, have a pretty decent defense for, uh, mid-last. Or not mid-last, red-eye. Alright, let's go. Oh my god, I hate how far he's stretching. I don't know if Freak does anything, but I'll still send him. We do have rants. Is it better? I mean, the other two we're kind of strategically dealing with. I'm gonna go conservative and go like Mickey, Midlass, Satella, Freak, and then we can just leave. But is that putting too much AIDS? Kind of, but like, who cares? How's Kentro doing? He's fine, I guess. Alright. Maybe we can get a lucky... Lucky Mickey hit at Red Eye. Probably shouldn't bed for that, though. I hate you, stupid. Wait, attack for sure? Aw. Oh. This is... It's no good. This body can't stand against the Toshin. Okay, more dialogue. Hey, old man. The end? Has the... Day finally come for me to become a Toshin too. After all this time. Ooh. All right. God damn, he killed all my shit. Okay, she's good at least. Not too worried about anyone else. Now we leave. All right. I probably shouldn't bat everyone. Whatever. Oh, these guys. Smoke was rising from the ends of Rona's hair and her torn clothing. Ah, <sighs> feels good. Me enjoy tormenting you, Rona. Rona was being tormented with Red Eye's magical magic attacks, flame arrow, and ice arrow. Both were weak attacks. That was Red Eye's consideration for the person it couldn't kill. Goohoo. Red Eye sighed with satisfaction. Rona sat unsteadily next to it. No problems with the child in you, Rona? Answer, you, Rona. Ice arrow. Ah, the ice that covered Rona's body made her stream. It's okay, I think. I see, that's okay. 
If the child is born happily, Rona, me free you. Huh? You freed him. Happy? Rona was happy, but it didn't know what would happen if she responded, so she only hung her head. Stupid idiot. All me needs is Castina family's blood. If the 25th generation of Castina has happy birthday, you will be minced and made child's food. If I have the child, I'll be killed. What red I need is in a container. It's my bloodline. The blood of my ancestor. Inside me. That'll be passed down to my child. Rona, no standing round. If you have time to do that, polish me beautiful body, okay? You have no other talents, okay? Y yes. Rona frantically went to get a towel, then began to carefully wipe Red Eye's body. Well, Gautia. Okay, Kite's not attacking. That's good. King Rance, if you don't act, Old Zeth will be occupied. I guess we just leave it. That's where the poison is. Alright. Well, at least Kite's gone for now. I think he's probably just gone, though. Hmm? Gautier was eating through the city's food the same way he always did. He frowned. This peach, it's stealing my ton more than usual. What's going on? Well, whatever. It's different. Oh, this one stings too. Nom 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 nom. Yep, this texture's to die for. I should eat more. King Rance, it seemed Gautier ate the poison food. I see, so he's alive. What? Apparently, he can even eat poison food without a problem. Ugh. Damn you, Kautia, you're eating me out of my money. Here's an order. Maris, have food with more dangerous poison spread where is going next, alright? Yes, understood. Ooh. Kessorin. And a maid. Kessorin's castle. The moon's beautiful tonight. It is, Mr. Kessorin. Kessorin was elegantly looking at the moon from his balcony. His eight maids were lying like they were watching over him. The humans are approaching. Huh? The maids all started talking. Do you girls miss the world you came from? No, Mr. Kesserin. They all said in unison. These maids were all baptized by Kesserin. They were bitten in the neck by a vampire. They became immortal, and the purpose of their life became to take care of Kesserin. Okay, so he's actually a vampire. Interesting. It was part... Partially because they were bitten, but it also, but but it was also half of their own will that they served Kesselrin, this deeply benevolent vampire. You girls stay here. I'm going. I'm leaving to kill humans, Mr. Kesselrin. Don't worry, I won't die for you girls as well as myself. Kesselrin walked up to the maids without making a sound. Altaria, Elcio, Canayo, yes, Lilim. Perola, Sharon. Yes, Mr. Kesselrin. Barbara and Varen. Yes. I'm entering the fight. I leave the castle to you. Understood? Be careful, Mr. Kesselrin. The maids said to Kesselrin without losing their composure. Varen. Yes? You did once. You get one stamp. You did a beautiful job polishing my coffin. Kesselrin held his hand out to Varen. Ah. She hurriedly pulled her stamp card out of her pocket. Kesserin officially took and pressed a stamp on it. It was a great honor to to the maids to receive a stamp from Kesserin. When they got a lot, they some they got to go somewhere alone with Kesserin. Ah, uh, thank you. I'm glad. Now, my loves. The balcony was glowing silver from the moonlight. Kesserin vanished from it without a sound. The maids bowed low and saw him off. Then nobody was left on the balcony. One of the elite four demons slowly began to move. Papaya's tower, sky above. Shall I go? Gestern units flew toward its destination. Oh no. Okay, so they're at just attacking. I wonder if we can beat Kesserin if we just take over his castle. Oh, he's not there. Well, I literally can't do anything about this. Because I. Yeah, I shouldn't have used my guys on Red Eye. Whatever. Damn. We're losing money. Hey, Rance. Okay, this is... So, we were doing a good job, I guess. What is it, old man? Did you confuse this room for the bathroom? 
No, I'm working for you right now, so I figured I should tell you before I leave. You're leaving? Yes, I'll be back though. I'll come back as a Toshin. A Toshin? I believe me becoming one is the best way to defeat Red Eye. I'm going to Siberia for a bit. Siberia's... so long. Yeah, I don't really get it, but make sure you come back. If you betray me, you're getting stomped in the crotch. Ta 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 ta. Free chattered as he left Rance. Gramps! Oh, Patton. What's this? Looks like you're prepared for a journey. Mm-hmm. I'm going out for a bit. I'll be back soon. Where are you going? Patton. Hmm? Become a great ruler, with or without me. Gramps? Take care of Hanty. She's a beloved friend to me. Hey, Gramps, what are you? Cha 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 cha. Gramps! This may be the last time I see ever see you in this form. Thus, free to part on a journey, a journey to make himself a Toshin. Helman, north of Siberia. Freak was standing in a blizzard, unable to see more than a meter in front of him. Ugh, it's hard being old. Hmm, should be around here somewhere. Freak raised his staff and began to chant a spell. Rumble. Rumble, rumble. A pyramid rose out of the snow. I can't believe I'm returning to Omega here. It was the entrance to the incomplete final Toshin City, Omega. Here it goes. Freak went inside. Freak's footsteps were the only sound inside the over 500-year-old relic of war. Is it here? Freak opened a heavy door. Torsion City Omega Arc. Freak was supposed to be the man who would become the final Toshin Omega in the Demon War long ago. However, Freak refused to become Omega, but he did rebuild Omega so he could control it himself and hide it there for the inevitable war with the demons. It was a long yet short life. Freed sat in the chair of the, in the chair in the ark. It was the chair for copying all of the memories in his brain into Omega's. Where? There's a low mechanical sound. Oh God, that looks kind of spooky. Omega, another me. Rune, MM Rune. Let me use this. With this, I'll defeat the demons. I'll make up for back then, if I can. It'll all be. Fine. <sighs> Freed's memories were transported into Toshin Omega's brain. All right. Thus, the voice came out from Omega's was just like Freed's. Omega slowly moved. Helmet north of Siberia. Freed, rather, Omega was standing in the snow once again. Wait for me, Red Eye. I'll be sure to stop you. Omega headed towards Lysus. Okay. Thought it would be a. Uh... He's here? I don't know. I guess you'll have to wait until next episode because we're wrapping it up. Pretty good episode. I think Kite's done for. Is there a way to look on the wiki? Because Babalot's done for. Even though his ending was kind of weird. He's just chilling buried. Or it'd be under water. I guess, walk through Monster Realm. Okay, ignore everyone else. Kite. Against Kite the Muscle Demon, there will be several end of turns events where he visits Green Village after the one where he tells Calorie a story. We'll learn from Maris about his visit to Green Village. We didn't even learn about Maris. We didn't learn from Maris about his visit to Green Village, I think. I think we just went there. <laughs> nice. Okay, so, you can also defeat him. Defeating a Titan this way will get you Calorie's happy end, but killing Titan in combat will get her, will get you her unhappy end. I guess because you don't, like, make love with them. Note that you need to control the Stronghold Nested Green Village in order to explore it. Okay, well, that's good enough. Well, if you just kill him normally, I would actually be pretty sad for the girls, just never finding a cure. But anyways, we are done for now. Thank you for watching. Next time we'll... I don't know. We have a freaking... Giga Chad Freak Toshin. Ready to fight Red Eye. So we can probably take him down next episode. Castle Rain's on the attack. I wonder if attacking his maids while he's away might be... The play. Um, Gautia's eating poison food. We're planning that one out. 
Our, ton our uh, tons shoes on this side is looking a little rough, but I feel like we're starting to get under control. Also, Medusa's dead. We did kill Medusa. Kind of sad we didn't get uh, each scene because she's kind of hot. And I, you know, I'll be honest, a man of honesty. The Camila each scene was pretty top tier, so I thought uh, Medusa's might be good, but. I guess it is not to be. But th again, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Next time we'll continue the demon war on Chichito Rants. Bye for now.